Hi, Howie Perks with American Benefit Services Marketing Team. And in this video, what I wanted to do was share with you an easy to use quote and enroll system that's going to make your life a lot simpler. So if you're a Medicare Advantage agent, you're out there selling Medicare Advantage only plans, Medicare Advantage prescription drug plans, and standalone PDP plans, this system is going to help you do your business in a much, much simpler way. So again, this system will not only quote Medicare Advantage for you, but you can also do a complete compliant enrollment. And I'm going to walk you through this system right now. So here we are on the dashboard. So when you first get access to, to Medicare Center, you'll be taken to this dashboard. And again, if you decide to work with us and you put Medicare Advantage contracts with us, you're going to get access to this system for free. And again, it's going to help you simplify your day to day activities. So once you log in, you'll be taken to this dashboard and the dashboard will let you know where you're at with all your policies. As you see, it'll walk you through a client snapshot from new all the way down to maybe if you lost the policy, it'll track that for you. And then also give you a policy snapshot up here of who was declined, applied, issued, and unlinked. And all you need to do is click on the number and that'll show you the actual policies that you have in the system um, that correlate with um, each individual um, policy snapshot up here. You can also set up reminders. Um, you know, the system also acts as a CRM. So when you create a content which contact, which I'll show you in a moment, you can set up reminders once you're on the contact dashboard. So when you come to your dashboard, you just click on reminders and it'll show you that you need to maybe follow up with somebody, maybe talk to somebody about a cross sale or something like that. So it's acting as a client relations manager for you, again, for all your Medicare Advantage client needs. And then also has recent activities. So, you know, as you're going through uh, your quote and enroll, the system will save that data. And when you're adding doctors, when you're adding prescriptions, when you're adding pharmacies, uh, it's going to go ahead and track that activity in the recent activity here for you and uh, make your life much simpler. So let's show you where you need to start. So initially what you're going to do is you're going to create contact. You're going to go to the contact page. Here's some test profiles that I made just for an example. As you see, it'll go through the stage of when somebody's brand new, when somebody's engaged. Basically, you sent the scope of appointment to them or when somebody turns into a client. You know, Let's say you do a full enrollment through the system and the system will uh, basically talk to Medicare Center in the background and the policy will be pulled back into the system, let you know that you now have a new client. Um, with that. So the first thing you would do is you can either import a group of contacts. If you have an existing list that maybe you want to bring into the system, you can import them or you can add them new one by one. So importing is really simple. Um, the system will let you know what you need to do. It'll provide you with a template. You can download the template, um, add your information, your client's information to the template, and then have that re-uploaded back into the system. And now you'll have all your contacts listed under the contact tab or you can add them one by one you just put your you know the first name middle name last name all the different information with birth date and their address and then um, you go ahead fill out all the information and create click create contact and then that'll take you to the record page which you see right here on one of my test contacts here and this is where it acts as a full CRM before you, before you actually get into the quote and do the enrollment with your client. You got to make sure that you get your scope of appointment. I'm going to show you how you can do that within the system, which is going to make your life really, really simple. Uh, you can go ahead and go to connect and then go to scope of appointment, click send new. And what the system will do will pre will pre-populate their email or text message, or you can add a new email or mobile number in order to send them the text message. Now you can do this while you're sitting with your client face to face, or you can do this remotely. Um, the system will allow you to send a text to them. Um, normally what you're going to do is click text message, and then go ahead and click send scope of appointment. It also has an additional feature, which will help you stay compliant with the 48 hour SOA rule uh, to where it won't allow you to complete your agent portion until uh, that you know 48 hours has passed and you can go ahead and com complete your portion once your client has submitted the scope of appointment. So we're going to send this to our client. 
Um, you can walk your client through. Uh, we can talk more about that. If you decide to work with us, I will do a full training with you on Medicare Center to teach you how to send a scope and how everything uh, works with that. And then here is where um, you can add the providers, prescriptions, and pharmacy. As you see, I added a doctor here. I'm going to go ahead and add one um, for an example. So you're going to click add new. So let's search for a new doctor. Let's go ahead and say maybe Candace Jones. You can also just put the, the last name in or first name. It's gonna search for you. Let's see if we can find a, a doctor here. Um, you can change the distance. So if you're talking to your client and they give you a doctor, you're not finding them, you can change the distance, you can change the zip code. So here we go, we have Candace Jones. Let's look at some locations. If you're, obviously you put the location, if you know the location, um, let's go North Cedar, that's the location. The system will update and as you'll see, the new doctor will now be listed. And now we can go down and go to prescription. So I have a prescription here already in the system for this test client. I'm gonna click add new. Let's just say Lipitor. The system's gonna go ahead and pre-populate. I'm gonna click Lipitor, add prescription. Click the dosage, add the prescription, and then the system will update in the background. Now we have Lipitor uh, and, a, and a second prescription here. Now we can go ahead and choose the pharmacy. Let's just say they like to go to CVS. Let's move out the mileage, see if we can find a CVS. There we go, they like that one. Let's click add pharmacy. So now you add it your provider prescriptions and pharmacy. Now you can go ahead and start your quote. So now we're taken to the plan comparison page. If you're familiar with medicare.gov, you'll see this is very similar to medicare.gov. You can scroll down, see all the plans listed. And then also you'll see that your pharmacy doctors and prescriptions, the system will let you know if it's covered for that particular carrier. So you can click on one of one, see the CVS, one of two doctors. So one doctor is covered, one's not, um, or in the network. So you see Ashley is in the network. Dr. Jones is not in the network. You can go ahead and edit that. Uh, maybe it's a different location that's in the network where um, you know, 809 Cedar is not in the network for um, Aetna. And then your prescriptions to see if your prescriptions are covered. As you see, you have the, this prescription here is covered. Um, you see Lipitor is not. The cool thing about the system, you can click on edit and the system will recommend a generic if there's a generic option available. You can go ahead and click this. Let's go to the generic, let's change the dosage, let's update the prescription. And in the background, you'll see the system's gonna update and now you're gonna see that now we have two of two prescriptions covered. So let's go ahead and scroll down, two of two. Now we see the generic version of Lipitor is covered and then this other um, prescription is covered as well. You can always add more prescriptions um, as you go. Uh, so as you see, the system makes it really super simple for you to make sure that the prescriptions are covered, the doctors are in a network, and find preferred pharmacies um, for that. And then you can go ahead and compare. If you want to compare plans, click on compare. You can compare up to three, just like with Medicare.gov if you ever use that. Uh, and then just click on compare. And It'll put them side by side so that you can go ahead and maybe do some of your own due diligence as you see here, you know, the green check marks show you, show you for this particular test client whether or not their prescriptions, doctors, and pharmacy are um, going to be covered for that particular carrier. As you see, it's a simple to use system, an all in one solution for all your quote enroll needs also acts as a CRM for, for your Medicare Advantage clients um, so that it makes your life easier as an agent. You don't have to go around to the different agent portals, log in, do the quoting in there. You can come to one system, quote all the carriers, and then do your enrollment through one simple system. And again, if you decide to work with us, uh, you put some Medicare Advantage contracts with us, PDP contracts, you'll have access to the system, and then you and I will do a full training. I'll walk you through, we'll do a Zoom, and I'll teach you exactly how to use the system. Any questions, please contact us. Uh, if you like this video, click like, drop us a comment or a question. We'd love to, to help you in your journey at becoming a successful Medicare
Medicare agent. If you're a seasoned Medicare agent out there, love to have you on board. If you don't have access to a system like this, we'd love to help you um, be able to get access to this and also help you in other ways and you know, walk along beside you in your journey um, building your Medicare business. Thanks for watching. Hope this helped you. We look forward to partnering with you and watch our channel. We like to put out a lot of valuable content to help you with your Medicare business. Whether you're a brand new agent looking to get in the business or you're a seasoned agent, we try to make sure that we're putting out information that's going to help you uh, build your business uh, every step of the way. Thanks for watching.